Hey, Sagittarius, baby, what's up? I hope you're having a good day. I hope you're having a good birthday, right? And um, this Scorpio Taurus energy, someone's in their feelings or their foundation. It's something about it they're going to have to learn to listen. They're going to have to break shit down and restart. Because the messages they're giving you, you don't like them. What's, what actions need to be taken to get something accomplished? They're not taking actions to get things accomplished with you. They harden the intellect. It's in reverse. That's why you're moving on. Uh, they feel like they need to move forward with this. And they thought they was going to move forward and get lucky with this seven. <clears throat> this reverse soulmate. And they didn't want to take no time to do it. So they tried to rush in fast with you and manifest or try to get you pregnant. That's what caused this separation. And that's what put this Ten of Pentacles in reverse. So this person could be in the Ten of Pentacles in reverse with their family members or with the people they with at home because they have no heart there. <clears throat> And they're not reflecting love with this six. Or they feel like with that six, whatever they want is not reflecting what's deep within their core of who they are being. Right? They want to have a reason. They want to have goals. They want to accomplish things. And it's not happening. Okay? So that's 16 right there. 16 signs of encouragement and support is not there. So they're over there. Whoever they're with is blocked out of reality. And they don't cooperate with them. Because <clears throat> they have no religious factors in their life. And they're dealing with the narcissist. You probably ask this person, was there a narcissist? And they won't even tell you if they are or not. And it's not the point of them telling you they are or not. They don't want to. It's like this person wants to control you. And they don't get that's not how you be in a relationship. What situation in your life do you need to be logical about? With this going on, this person know they're not single. And they're working on something. That's 18 positive change. That's what you're working on. Keeping an open mind about your intimacy, about your love life. Because this person was lying to you. They a liar. And you want to just free yourself. You're attracting some kind of energy. And you're using your intuition. And you're standing your emotions. You're balancing your emotions. When it comes to this, these feelings upside down. With this person. This uh, water Earth sound. Are you prepared to receive or give love offer? No. Or I feel like they're probably not dealing with the water air sign and they're probably not ready to give a love offer to them. But this could be you. It doesn't matter what sign you are, it's the energy. Yeah. So whoever's not reflecting love is in this emperor, empress energy. They want power, but they feel fulfilled with what they put their energy and time in. They might have gambling problems or financial problems or addicted to gambling. And it's not worth the wait. So I feel like they're dealing with someone that have addictions and gambling problems. And they, they feel like they're not going to go anywhere with this person. This person probably an alcoholic or a dope head or whatever. They feel like they're seven, they're going to get lucky somewhere else. And I feel like that's with you. Yes. They judgment with that flag. What's trying to get your attention? That you have no passion with the person you're with. That won't let them go. But they have clarity. So they probably know that they're dealing with the narcissist. And that's what they keep it to themselves. 
and they feel this narcissist that they're dealing with or that is feeling trapped or this could be you. That's 18 again, friend. Yeah, you want some kind of positive change. Or because y'all are uh, soulmates in reverse, this person probably feel like you do. You want to make some positive changes. Yeah, friend. 18 again. With the hidden secret. It's safe to love. They feel like they don't want this narcissist to get in the way of their relationship. Probably with you. Yeah. A new love has stirred up probably this narcissist's romantic feelings. Yeah. And they probably confess that. Or maybe they're telling this person that you are their new love and, you know, they have romantic feelings for you because they don't have it with the person that they're with. Hello, water, fire sign, earth, air sign. What is this? What situation in your life requires slow motion and determination? What situation in your life you need to analyze and research? That's what you've been doing. Or that's what this person been doing. Lack of balance, poor financial decisions. Okay, that could be me with that Jupiter energy. Like, I didn't get this job I really wanted, but at the same time, I didn't know if I could do it. I could, uh, the, I've driven a bus for a metro before, the <clears throat> metro lift, and it's, it picks up people that's in the um, special need community. And I didn't do good driving that bus. I did my best, but I didn't do good. And it didn't feel like it was going to last. So the truck they wanted me to drive this time was way bigger than that. So I was like, hell no. And then, uh, but it wasn't that big. Yeah, it was big. It's a big truck, but I mean, I wouldn't have to be driving locally, you know? So I was like thinking of it in that way. And then I would have been putting food on the airplane. And I was like, I've never been to airplane. I've never been up close to airplane and I do not do heights. So I, I was like thinking, okay, it's time to step out my comfort zone. But then I'm like, then I'm not going to be, that was really not according. That really wasn't a according to my plans in life. I really like to do security so I can do my energy reads. I can get paid by YouTube and I can do start my own business in that way focused. I know with this job, I won't be able, and then it paid more. It didn't pay that much more, but it was the point of I would have got comfortable. And I feel like that was my bad financial decision. Because remember, sometimes things don't happen because um, you supposed to be the millionaire, billionaire, or starting a business in your generation to break curses. And it's like, spirit is saying no. Spirit, no, I'm going to get comfortable. So, yeah. Uh, I feel like when you don't have bills or kids or something monkey, I call it, on your back, you don't tend to do more. So it's like, um, I did, I was smoking, I started smoking almost three months ago, I've been drinking my little ginger, and my, um, lemonade, and I've been detoxing, but not for the drugs, I'm just doing it to be healthier, so, I permanently stopped, made up my mind to start smoking, but I didn't know that it takes up to three months to get out your system, not just two, so that's why I felt the drug test, but I feel like that was a sign, because at the last job I took when I was smoking, I had to take a drug test, and I passed it, so that's why I thought I could take it after almost three months, it haven't been a full three months, that I should be clean, right, so I didn't look at it in a bad way, so know that <clears throat> it was blocked, and this person's intuition is blocked. Or they could be indecisive and feeling weak. Yes. This narcissist female or male, he's the gossip of uh, conversation. 
That's why they have an anxiety and deep unhappiness and stress, feeling burdened. Burden out here again. That's how your person could feel with the communication with this Gemini dealing with a narcissist over you. So I guess if you would have got back with this person, it would have proved to people that they wasn't going to break y'all up or that um, you do understand what he's been through if he's been sexually abused. But... That's not for you to do, now is it? <laughs> it damn sure ain't you returning back to your faith. You returning back to your intimacy. Yes. Having an open mind. What areas of your life cause you to be creative? That's what spirit wants you to do. Yeah. But they don't want you to let go of something. What situation in your life do you need to be more logical about? And I feel like that was with this job. That's why I didn't kind of get upset. But I think that you not letting go, you need to be more logical about this third party that could have been that job. See, it's like you and your person is kind of chasing money. That's why y'all haven't gotten back to each other. You and your person is picking money over each other. When if y'all just get together, y'all probably will have a lot more going on. But y'all both are not seeing it that way. Because y'all are celebrating. Socializing and shit. And this also could be this person's friends. That's the third parties. And my friends could be y'all. I'm more focused on this. Right? Then try to reconcile with him. Yeah, but. They want to surrender and change. And walk away. Self-sacrifice. Yes, that's what the time moment is. You're going to have to self-sacrifice. They said have a lack of. They have unrealistic expectations. Okay, so that's the difference. You probably had unrealistic expectations trying to take on a job you knew was going to take away from the kids or from um, what you really want to do. And I really feel like this person just got unexpected expectations as if you was going to be with them and fuck around with this narcissistic ass person. Because this bitch is refusing to compromise. Yep, I just seen forceful this. You can be blocked by obstacles, that's all. Yes, this person is in a relationship, Scorpio Tori, that's unrequired love. And that's what they being more logical about. They want to take some other kind of route that makes them in that devil energy, but temptation when it comes to their heart. Yes, honey, honey. Yes. This person, have a, both of y'all might have a lack of balance or direction right now. This is bad timing. But I feel like with this card... And then want to manifest or get you pregnant or knowing that you are pregnant if this is you. They're losing momentum because they're coming out upright. Yes, unexpected change and huge loss. When it comes to this narcissist they were dealing with. Of course you go through a lot of unexpected financial disasters when you're dealing with the narcissist. And you over here changing traditional ways. There we go. Knowledge. Sharing social groups. You want to change that. That's how you feel about your third parties. You want to change how you're, how you're working. And that could be just working for people. Are going with more professional people. This person has no heart. 
They want to release the pain and depression. They want forgiveness. And you've already forgiven this person. That's why you called them to see where their mind was. And they steady want to play with you. Yeah, what I tell you, king of wands in reverse, they're dealing with someone that want them to compromise. So they could also have, I got in the reading, okay, we know for some of y'all this person is confused about their sexuality. Or uh, this person right here, moving in the masculine energy, this narcissist, this could be a woman. There's all cares about is self-promotion. So your person just care about self-promoting themselves. It's like, you going about getting money the right way because this bitch won't act right. You're not putting money over people. This motherfucker just won't act right. Yeah. Refuse an offer. That's what you did. You're bored, depressed for some of y'all. Missed opportunities. Was forced. I had a feeling because I didn't feel bad about it. I was like, what's wrong with you? the hell when you got this message in reverse you're using your intuition before it bites you in the ass yeah for attraction the attraction romance love by enjoying the moment fullingly you want to enjoy your life fullingly you cause I like I could retire at this job but that's that never was my plan And then I was thinking for some of y'all, it's kind of like, I was also saying like, what if I get, if I don't make this job or if I do make it and I don't want to be here no more because I have to work in a fucking freezer. I said, uh, where else I'm going to make this kind of money, honey? <laughs> so it never was somewhere to retire. Fear of the unknown, impulsive, that's how your person fear, feeling. This person don't, you know, like, you know this person been talking about you. You probably been talking about them. So you probably be, don't feel like it's safe to go around them. Y'all been in a little war going on. You don't know if they going to get you jumped or try to act funny when you get there. You don't want to go through that. Yeah. That's why you blocking your feelings. When this person try to take route, they just not getting it. Yes, honey, you're alien. You get what you need to do. Whatever this person's been broadcasting was in reverse. So I guess by you getting back with them, like I said, would have made people think that um, I, uh, she came back to me. And for some of y'all, y'all do go back to this person to see if they get it now. And they're not getting it. Well, maybe they're changing because these... People are coming in upright. So they could be dealing with a brother or a friend that's a liar. And they looking fucking stupid because they the last one standing. So it's going to be a fucking real punch in their face if y'all do get back together. A punch in a lot of these narcissistic ass people face that's probably in his family. So the third party could be this family that's in reverse. Just like you, you was raised around nothing but narcissists. Oof. Explain a lot of shit. Them people are sick. Yeah, privileged. You're going to get an unexpected change.
You're not second and third guessing yourself about what you need to do. Five, change. How you coming across your money, honey, in these third parties. Yeah, this person's using they good for bad if they ain't got no heart, right? So this person probably celebrating and doing things for people in this family and they really don't even like them or they just going along with the flow when they really want to come be with you. Yeah, standing up for themselves at a significant time when it comes to this uh, king of wands in reverse. Devilish. So this person is forced on, focused on self-promoting. So they, this could be a twin or identical twins or someone really close to them that want to just use them. And they need them to do it because they might be the ugly fucking brother or the ugly one in the fucking group or they want to use your person and they know if they come towards you, you're not going to play that shit. Or they probably just don't want to see this person with somebody that looks they have a better relationship than they do or ever had <laughs> yeah yeah there will be no love and gaslighting yeah loss there will be no creativity if there is no lack, that purpose is creativity and intuition too. This person is not going to be successful. There is no, let me tell you something. It's very rare. And that's you talking about with a mom. That a man is successful without a good woman. Or that he will stay successful. Like even if he make a lot of money, honey. If he don't have a good woman on his side or she don't have a good man on her side. It's not going to work even when she do make money. It ain't going to work. It ain't. It's not going to work. They're going to constantly be triggered. Because you're keeping up the good job. Or this person is keeping up a good job. When it comes to this uh, family dynamic. About probably not having feelings towards them either. I guess this person just trying to see things through. Because they're around a bunch of energy vampires, yep. They probably know people want to see them fail or going to laugh to see them not doing good with you. Because you're not a fucking narcissist. And they don't have to second and guess about that shit, proud community. What the fuck is up? Yeah, your person being calm, what I told you. And trying to stay fulfilled around this family. Yeah. Their energy is real like yours. That's why they over there all up on your person. Yeah. Your person standing up to whoever this brother, cousin, or whoever got in the middle of this relationship. It could be their dad or their son or a co-worker. Yeah, you're not a simp. This person trying to stay in their lane. Told you. So this person is not going to make it big without you. Because I feel like you're going about it the right way and they're not. They probably would have took that job. Knowing that that's not part of the plan. Snack. You looking like a triple threat. Uh-huh. Okay, because it's like. You, this is your energy looking good, but triple threat is support. And that's what they say on the back of this card. The finest of the fine. When you out in these streets. I, I don't know if they can reverse or not, but I feel like. It also with this moon could be a hidden secret. That this person really like you, of course, because they're around energy vampires. And they want to stand up for themselves because they know they rare too. Impact energy. Hello. They bitching and standing up for themselves. I told you. Confirmation. 
Yes, they know these people have no more to carry, but they just depart. They want to be solo. They need self-care, they feel. Of course they would if they have to pretend around these people. They don't want to say fuck you. They got all their information. You're not a red flag and neither are they. You're not trauma bonding when they come towards you, if they even do. Yeah, you don't need therapy, excuse me. The red flag is in reverse because now at first this person probably didn't know these people were jealous of them. And now that's probably why they feel like they really need self-care. Yeah, and they don't want to fight with their demons no more. If you want to get a personal reading, let me know. I've been updating my description box. Yeah. Earth is in reverse. The foundation, the relationships are in reverse. Childhood in reverse. Secrets are out. That's why this person is triggered. They probably family don't know they've been sexually abused or know that they putting them down or know that they've been sleeping with their boyfriends and girlfriends behind their back or flirting with their girlfriends and boyfriends behind their back. Yeah, this motherfucker's standing their ground. Shedding the old and letting go, uh, letting go of people. That's what came out. Oh, I guess I should. Oh, I put it down. Sorry. Yes, this is what this person want: prosperity and growth. So maybe they are separate from this baby mama. Or they're separated from trying to manifest with them of someone that's pregnant. Or pregnancy means manifest. Maybe they're trying to separate, trying to manifest with these people. Ooh, we doggy. Make an investment. Lies being exposed. Ah. This person look at you as a dream, a fantasy. Yeah, these people about to have a time moment. Yep, it's like that was your important, your important person, your important. You had a time moment because that was something you needed to learn and keep focus on that you're not supposed to be working for anybody. And this person, damn sure, ain't supposed to be working to impress people. Hello, emotional intelligence. You need to have patience, Sagittarius. Get a new job. Self-employment is on this card. Yep. Because that's what I do want. Building the business. Reputation. I don't want a reputation, but... Uh, craftsmanship, quality. I'm not just trying to build on YouTube, but it helps with the brand that I'm trying to do. I have a lot of projects I want to do, so if you need an idea on what you can get started on your own business, <laughs> let's do a reading. I bet I can help you. Letting go of the past. Relieving bondages. Do we need to keep going? You're going through temporarily financial shifts, negative changes in circumstances, excuse me, feeling left out and cold. Yep, that's how I was feeling after I got turned down, down because I'm going through my love life is shitty and these these guys ain't to me worth my time and I can see how stupid these hoes act in these streets. I feel sorry for these men. I had a young girl pass by me and tell these young boys, you think a nine to five is going to get you anywhere. You ain't going to never be shit in life. And I'm like, well, you got to start somewhere. And if she think like that, <laughs> when she get fucking older, because maybe she do hair or something, I don't know. But when she get older, she going to learn it's hard to find a woman or a man with a nine to five. <laughs> so you live and learn. So I hope this helped you and have a good day, boo.